Hi, welcome back to Wacky Wednesdays. So today we have something different. This is a Bluetooth speaker with Amazon Echo built into it. It's a smart speaker. This is one of the my favourite things I've bought over the last six months. So this is made by a company called Kit Sound, and they're actually British. So you can see a little badge on there. I'm going to show you around. It's finished in like a grey material. The speakers are down the side there, and the side there, and one at the front. And then your subwoofer is at the back. It's quite heavy, this. So your subwoofer's at the back. You also have power in. You've got 2.1 amp USB out. You've got line in, and you've got WPS to connect it up to your Wi-Fi. Only if you, if you don't want to do it the normal way. The only thing that's missing on this, I think, is an optical in it, which would have been great had it had it. However, when they think these came out, they were about £150. You can pick these up for £49.99 now. It actually comes in a really posh cantilever box that opens like that, a presentation box. I should have really put it in, but never mind. But it really is a nice piece of kit. It comes with the remote control, which is of really nice quality. It's not, this is not a cheap plastic remote control. It's heavy and it functions exactly as you want it to do and the distance is absolutely perfect for any distance. So, on the front of the system you've got a mute button, then you've got play next track, play and pause should I say, here's just a logo, and this button allows you to select your inputs. Bluetooth mode. So that's Bluetooth. Line in mode. Line in. Wi-Fi mode. And Wi-Fi. So as you can see the different colours, this is like a very light white and green. Then you've got blue is Bluetooth. Line in mode. And green's line in. Wi-Fi mode. So the, the great thing about this is you can use the Echo, have Bluetooth lined up to it and something on the line in all at the same time. This is absolutely superb if you want to use it for your computer because you could use the line in and have it for computer mode. Or you've got the Bluetooth mode. I have to sync this up to a TV, and the greatest thing about this is it has no latency whatsoever. There's nothing. So you can watch your TV on this, and there's no latency, which means you've got no syncing problems. So let me just show you how it works. So it connects up to the first thing it'll ask you to do is connect it up to the Wi-Fi. It's very simple, just follow what it tells you to do. And then there's an app called Kit Sound. So if we go into the Kit Sound app, sorry, let me show you that from the beginning. Shut it down and start up again. So this is a kit sound app, it's called KS Player. It's going to go in here and make sure this is connected, and it is. Now if you notice I've called this bedroom one. So you can have three of, you can have as many of these as you want set up. And, the, and then you select which one you want to listen to. If I had two set up, if I selected the one underneath it and dragged it and put it on top of the bedroom one, say this one was lounge, they'd both play the same track simultaneously, with no lag. It, and you could do that as many times as you want. So you can have four or five of these set up in your house and have the same music playing for every room or different music in every room. Absolutely fantastic piece of kit it is. Also in here you've got, this is your player which I'll show you in a minute how that works. Then you've got all the different systems it can use. So you can use My Music obviously what's on your phone, you've got TuneIn, Heart Radio, Spotify, Tidal, Napster, Amazon Alexa which is obviously connected to and you can add as many services as you want. So it will stream anything to it from your phone. So if you've got it, if you can stream to your phone, it's going to stream through. And obviously you've got Bluetooth and you're connected to anything Bluetooth by hitting that button. If you go into settings, you've got, I don't know, play some music and then that's easy to show you. So I have this rigged up, I don't have it rigged up to anything Bluetooth down here, but I have got it set up to um, Alexa obviously. So let's just do that. So the normal Alexa thing works, so you can go, Alexa, what time is it? Sorry, I haven't got it on the mic mode, have I? let's put it onto... Bluetooth mode. Line in mode. Wi-Fi mode. So Wi-Fi is what you need to have it on for Alexa, obviously. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 11.12am. Now as you can see, it works like all the other Alexas do. 
This one has multi-languages, so you can select whatever language you want to put it in. This is mine's on obviously English UK. It comes, I think, American, which is weird because it's an English set. So, Alexa, what's the weather like today? Alexa, what's the weather like today? Currently, in Staley Bridge, it's 5 degrees Celsius with partly sunny skies. Today, you can expect intermittent clouds with a high of 8 degrees and a low of 5 degrees. Right, so I can tell you straight away, this thing sounds a lot better than the large Amazon Echo. A lot better. The speakers in this are pumpy. There's a lot of bass produced. The treble's decent on it. It's not muffled. It really is a nice piece of kit. And if you're watching TV on this thing, it's absolutely amazing. When you watch TV through so something Bluetooth, sometimes the sound can drown out the voice. And that happens a lot on Bluetooth stuff. This isn't, it's got a very clear voice. So let's select some music. Alexa, play songs by Ed Sheeran. Shuffling songs by Ed Sheeran on Amazon Music. Now, I'm not going to let it play for long for obvious reasons, but you can see on my screen it's come up with the track and the album. I can select next track on here. I, mean, I don't know if you can hear the quality has gone through the camera, but it really is nice. It's got a nice rich tone to it. It really is a nice bit of kit for the money. I was, I was shocked when I bought it. I've seen a review by someone else. Let's just turn that down. Obviously, I can turn the sound down with my phone or I can turn the sound down with the dial on the front or with the included remote control. So let's just stop that. So I don't get copyrighted. So, obviously this is your remote. Volume up, volume down, next track, so forth and so on. And then you can select your modes with this. And then on here, now this has a very large volume dial on here. Now if, it, if, if you see one of these or you buy one, you might think it's loose. It's actually a floating knob, so this feels like it's playing it. It's meant to be like that. It's called a floating knob, so it's got, it's like, like suspended if you like. But it means it's really nice to move. It's effortless. I really do like this thing. For the cost, I think it's absolutely amazing. I've got the Amazon Echo, I've got the dot and stuff, but... This just surpasses it because of all the other things it can do. And trust me, if you want to connect this up to a computer, it does sound fantastic. The sound's rich. And for the price, I don't think you can go wrong. If you're interested in buying this, no one seems to have it. Well, on the internet, if you look around, there is some shop stuff selling it, but it's more money. If you search on eBay, there's hundreds of buyers got this for £49.99 in the UK. So yeah, this is highly recommended for me. If that's what you're looking for, I don't think you can get much better. So, just a quick brief one of what's coming up next on Wacky Wednesday. It's probably going to be two weeks, but we're going to have this. This is a Did You Wi-Fi doorbell. So, if you've seen the Ring doorbell, where you can answer your door from wherever you want, and it picks it up on your phone, this is exactly the same, so I'm going to review this, and I've also got the extension bell to go with it. So, I have tried it, it works fantastic, I'm going to catch it up to my house, and do a proper video of it installed, and show you installing it, but it might be two to three weeks before I get that up, but that's what's going to come next on Wacky Wednesday. Thanks ever so much for watching, have a fantastic day.